bed is on the Titan. What a fish. What a fish. Look at this. What a nice fish. Oh my goodness, guys. This is a nice big solo action fish. You saw the presentation with the Titan. I'll show you some more on how we did it in a second. All right, guys, the Titan. Putting in some work today with my main man, Jim. Fishing Fun. with MG. We just tag team one. Sort of tough conditions. Mm -hmm. We're fishing in the North Woods. It's been slow. You know, yesterday was a hot day where we are seeing some big fish. Today, it's the aftermath thereof. You see yep. some big ones, you're gonna pay the price. What do you do on these slow days? As you can see, there's not a lick of wind out here. We've got cabbage, bugs and stuff finally starting to move. Cold front conditions. You always hear gliders and dive and rise. The Titan from Livingston Lures is money. It just oh. gets it done. Really unique line attachment system. Self tunes this bay every time you pull it, so it's not blowing out. Mm -mm. I mean, it's really we're, versatile too. Yeah, we're ripping on them as hard as you can rip on them. You can tap them. You can rip them. Actually, I think I was working, uh, and we'll see in the clip. But uh, I was working over top of some weeds. It's one of the only baits I've ever seen where you can actually pull up on the rod and the bait's gonna lift up and still do the dive and rise action. Yeah. So it's really got a unique twitch. So we're sort of contouring cover and structure to get this down where the fish are right now in these cold front conditions. Yeah, Guys, I'll show you how to work the Titan here in a second. All right, the Titan from Livingston Lure. This is one bad, bad, bad diving rise, and the musky shop's the only people that have them. This bait is gonna change the way you fish diving rise, I promise you that. It's got such a unique line tie and such a unique action that anybody can do it. Weekenders, children, anybody can now fish diving rise with this bait. It's superbly easy. One thing that you, a lot of guys do is, is when you're out fishing dive and rise, you sort of have to have a setup specific for that. You're bringing a shorter rod. You're bringing what we'd classically refer to as a jerk bait rod. I'm actually fishing the Titan on the new, and this is the prototype nine foot six heavy musky shop shield rod, and this bait will fly. The cool thing with the Titan is it's so easy to use is you can use it with turns of the handle, just with the reel, and you can do turn, turn, stop, turn, turn, stop, big jerks, big rips, big pulses, they're all gonna trigger strikes and this thing really is not gonna blow out on you. It's gonna be superbly easy. The, with this, is just a litany of ways you can retrieve that bait, as I said. I like to just use small taps, almost like I was fishing like a, 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 a hellhound or a phantom. That thing is gonna dive and rise. It's gonna do all the work for you. This is really gonna put dive and rise action within the grass, but a lot of anglers have struggled with some of the traditional baits to get them in tune. There's no tuning necessary. My favorite thing is this comes with a weight kit so you can adjust the weighting. So if you need to fish a little bit deeper, you need to fish shallower, you can change it out with just a quick Phillips head screwdriver or my trusty pocket knife. I change the weights with that. And then the tails, everybody's gonna ask about the tail. It has a corkscrew, no glue. You can just screw on whatever tail on there. And the Titan is gonna do all the work for you and put a big muskie in your net.